Hey you guys, I'm back with another video. And this time I'm doing a review of a place that I've never eaten at. I don't know if it's like a, a chain that every state has or if it's like a local chain for us. But I went to... Oh, they don't even have the name on the bag. Go figure, huh? This place is called Muya or Muha. There it is. The name is on the cup right here. And they make their own fresh chips. And they make healthy burgers, regular burgers, and healthy burgers. So I was very, very pleasantly surprised by that. So I was like, uh, I need to try this place to see if they're any good because they might be my new favorite look at that that's that's not even all of them and i have a full cup see that oh my gosh okay i'm about to eat these out the bag first look how good they look they're golden brown they're really good the only thing I'd have to say, like, negatively, they're a tad too salty for me. I don't like my chips, like, Princeton salt. I don't know if it's all of them, so we're going to see. It has a real good crunch. Like, I don't know if you can hear that. Real good crunch. The chips are really good. Not all of them are salted, like, really bad. A 9 out of 10. Because like I said, the only drawback, a lot of them are a little too salted for me. But they're cooked really well. They give you a large amount in the quantity. I can imagine what the medium size is. This is small. I can imagine how much they give you in the medium or in a large. Now we're going to try the burger. This is what they put it in. Cellophane. Tons of burgers to choose from. It's a burger place. Um... I chose the Paleo Burger because what I saw, oh, it's messy. Oh, you didn't give me any napkins. That's the only thing I don't like about that. You're going to give me a messy burger, but no napkins. So I'm about to go get my own napkins. It's got some of the Muha, Muya, I don't know how they pronounce it, dressing sauce on the cellophane right here if you can see that but look at this burger yes girl look at that and you can customize your own burgers like i said i picked the paleo because the paleo came with the iceberg lettuce that acts as the bun and the toppings I chose, I'm going to take my cover off. The avocado is on point. Oh, that girl is thick. Let's get into this. And I'm going to taste this muya sauce. Muya sauce is just... I'm sorry, it tastes like Thousand Island dressing to me. Let's try, let's go in for it. It sucked to hear. Let's go in. I had to go get a napkin because this thing is messy. Okay, here you go. Here you guys. This is a monster of a burger. They give you two Angus beef patties, avocado, apple smoked bacon. Grilled onions, onion strings, muya sauce all over this girl. She is saturated in sauce, okay? It is so good. I'm definitely going to buy this again. Oh, my goodness. Yes. And the cut fresh chips. I mean, come on. The burger is hands down 10 out of 10. Oh my goodness. I definitely going to order that again. So if you have a local Moo Ya or Moo Ha, I think it's Moo Ya. It's M-O-O-Y-A-H. 
in your town, go check them out. They are so good and they appeal to everyone's lifestyle. If you eat bread, eat. they have bread options. They have different amounts of buns to choose from. They have numerous amounts of toppings that you can customize your burgers any kind of way you want. And also they have good lifestyle burgers like the one I chose. They have paleo. They also have one that's called keto. They have the vegetarian burger. I mean, now I don't work at Muyas. I'm not sponsored by them either. I'm just saying from what I saw on the website and from being there too and the burger I just ate. So I'm giving you my opinion and it's good. It's really, really good. Overall, I give this meal an 8.5 out of 10. Homemade chips were too salty, a little bit for me, but the burger was on point. If you like this video, comment down below. And don't forget to like, subscribe, come join the family, Big Mama's family. And I'll be back in another video. Bye.